we have a brick. We lift this brick, which is of mass one kilogram. We lift it up uh, ten meters, and it takes us uh, five seconds to do this. What we're lo looking at is the power output that is required to do this. So the formula for power is the the work done over time or we could just write it the energy converted over time. In this case we've uh, lifted our mass up 10 meters so we're gaining gravitational potential energy mgh equals ep grav so uh, the energy will be mgh over the time it's taken. Uh, that means Putting the numbers in, the total power, or the rate of energy conversion, is going to be 1 kilogram times by force due to gravity, uh, gravitational field strength is 10 um, kilogram newtons per kilogram, times sort of the height you move it through is 10 meters, and the time it took was 5 seconds. Uh, so that equals 100 over 5, gives us 20 watts. So that's 20 joules of energy per second. You can see that makes sense because it's taken 100 joules of energy to lift it up and it's taken 5 seconds to do so. So that means every second you're doing one fifth of that 100 which is 20. So 20 joules per second, 20 watts.